Hey everybody, Rick Needham Handicapping Thoroughbred Racing from Santa Anita Park on Income Tax Day, Sunday, April the 15th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle, Southern California. Race of the day. Let's take a look at race 8 this afternoon, 4.07 p.m. Pacific Post Time. It's a six and a half furlong sprint on Santa Anita's Dirt Track, three-year-old fillies race for an allowance prize of $65,000. Contenders number three, Contested, number five, Dipsy, number four, Tis the Tide, and number one, Hidden Passion. Number three, Contested, takes a class drop as both the overall speed and pace profile leader sprinting at or about today's distance of six and a half furlongs on the dirt has hit the board in four of her two career starts to date, including a power run win to break her maiden her last time out. Jockey Martin Garcia and trainer Bob Baffert center to the post. They've hit the board with 56% and nearly 200 entry saddles as a team to date. Number five, Dipsy, a 9 2 shot, is hit the board in five straight, winning twice, including a power run win in her second race back. Race eight summary number three, contested, tops my contenders list today, which also includes number five, Dipsy, number four, Tis the Tide, and number one, Hidden Passion. 3541 in the 8th from Santa Anita. Bonus long shots, Woodbine, Race 8, here in the $150,000 Woodstock Stakes. The 8 to 1 shot, number 3, Oro Vero, has hit the board in power run fashion in both of his two career starts to date, including a power run win to break his maiden his last time out. Hawthorne Race Course, near Chicago, Race 4, number 4, Angel Talk. A 5 to 1 shot qualifies as a Trackmaster plus Power Pony. Takes a class drop of 5 units. Nice overall speed for this 6 for a long sprint. So, from Santa Anita Park in Southern California on a Sunday, as we wrap up another racing week here, Rick Deedham for the Equibase Winter Circle reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.